Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time on my channel and clicking on this video, my name is Poya Sek. If you are a subscriber and you are already watching my videos and you're coming back to update yourself, hello bro, hello sis, how are you doing? What I have for you guys today is a video on black owned clothing, black owned brands, black owned everything that I purchased this summer. So go ahead and get comfortable and we'll get right into it. Just before we go ahead and start this video, I just wanted to let you guys know that I did film this no makeup makeup look on my channel and the video should be posted already or it should come after this video, one or the other. In the beginning guys, this is going to be basically my black owned businesses haul, my black owned clothing and all the things that I purchased this summer from all the research that I did from brands and products that I wanted to try out to kind of incorporate in my everyday lifestyle and just things like that. And you guys know that I love sharing the products and the brands that I am learning about, purchasing from. A few people like the videos that I've been doing, so I really like sharing this journey and this process with you guys. And again, this is just to emphasize the importance of supporting black owned businesses, supporting black people, supporting um, just people in general. But for me, as you guys know, with everything that's going on with the climate of our environment, our government and our society, um, people of color and black people are still being targeted on every level possible. Today I'm filming this video on August 24th and yesterday the 23rd another black man was shot by a police officer or by multiple police officers and the things like these things don't stop happening. All I'm trying to do is find ways in my personal life and in my business whatever on all aspects of life to really emphasize the importance of what black lives matter means and to i can't have this conversation with a lot of people because a lot of people don't understand that it's more than just buying clothes it's more than just you know having your black friends it's just having respect for human beings at the bare minimum and that's what we are so since a lot of people don't know how to support us or to look at us as human beings or to respect us as that then me as a black woman as a black person uh, have to do what I can do to love and emphasize love and support within my own community within black people within women within um, just the people that I choose to circle myself around but yeah you know I'm just trying to find ways to incorporate and to help and support and I hope that you guys do the same thing by helping and support me um, share this video share the products share you know my business and share what I'm trying to do and yeah we're just like all I guess the new energy and the new era everything is supporting each other just trying to do right by each other and um, sustainability as well like I said I'm incorporating this into my lifestyle so that it's not like a Oh, I'm gonna support black businesses now and then after that like no it's gonna be a continuum it's a lifestyle that I'm trying to change I'm trying to incorporate so yes so anyways let's just get straight into the video and I hope you guys enjoy first thing I want to say is how I started this journey I a friend of mine actually he's been really helpful in sending me tweets and posts about people who are putting like black owned businesses black owned clothing black owned bags black owned anything especially on twitter like there's so many threads on like black owned things ever ever since things started to happen so i would just go into the threads and i would check out like the stores and the brands that people were um posting and showing off and threads are trying to show exposure for those black businesses and black products so i would just go through them and look at the things that like I found interesting and would want for myself so yeah this video is gonna be all the things that I found of course there are so many other brands out there but guys like just like I have been doing it you have to do the research as well so if you know of any brands or anything like that you know 
put them in the comments below so that people can be aware of other brands that they can check out and you know look at but um yeah again all these products are purchased with my own money with my own savings and everything so you know if you're a brand or a product owner or a business owner I don't know and you want to give your girl you know sponsor her so we can do more of this then girl I would I would dedicate the whole video to your product let me just tell you but you know like I said since I'm buying this on my own I can't really do you know buy everything in the world and show you guys this is black on black on if you see my video if you see my channel if you see my Instagram you like how your girl looks you want her to you know support your business emphasize you know put it on the pedestal so people know about it call me okay so for our first business brand that I purchased from clothing wise this is from the Willow J boutique I really love this dress so Again, this is my first time like showing my body <laughs> on camera, on everything, but I'm a model so I have to get used to it, but let me go ahead and show you guys. Um, this dress is a little bit explicit because she does show a little bit of side boobage, um, which I don't, I don't really mind about side boobage. I don't really care. It's just like on camera. I don't know what kids, I don't know whose mom is going to be watching me, but um yes this is the dress super cute yes i don't i have little booty matters <laughs> but this is the dress this is the back i feel like this is like going out with my friends for a brunch or a day i feel like people are not really into like the cut not everyone is but i definitely am into it so that's why i like it um and i like it because my arms can like sway i can breathe it's not too short it's like right above like my knee here but i really like this this is a fit okay, so for this next brand that i'm going to be showcasing i just want to say off the bat something that i've noticed right and they're another brand that i feel like can be a substitute for h m forever 21 those kinds of looks or even like a zara because they cute stuff but another thing this next brand i feel like they their audience is more like curvy girls because when i went online the girl who was modeling it the girls who are modeling it like definitely have hips but and everything i don't really have that and that's totally fine but i just thought that i could still buy it and like rock it I can, but I definitely feel like this line is for girls who are a little bit more curvy and stuff. So if you're, you know, a little bit more curvier, even if you're slim thick, you're slim like me, but you got, you know, I think this could be your thing too. But um, just me, you know, I buy things for my body. I don't really go out and buy things because I wanna, I wanna make my body work for it. I want the clothing to work for me. You know what I mean? Like when I get it, it's like this was made for me. If it's not made for me, I'm not gonna really go buy it because at the end of the night, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna be like, I look like trash. Like <laughs> I don't need to go through that. <laughs> so I buy what I know is gonna match my body type, match like my dimensions and everything because I want to look good. Um, this is a one size fits all dress. So I bought this, there was no size small, medium, large. This was the size. It's short, like definitely summer, summer vibes. Stick in the stomach. Um, you know, I'm going to the mall with my friends. I'm gonna go to a bar real quick. I feel like I can match this like with my new Nike Air Force Ones, but like, you know what I mean? Um, very stretchy, so however thick you are, like this is your dress because I feel like this is a one, this is a one size fits all. So it can, anybody can buy this. But um, yeah, obviously like the girl in the picture, like she was really curvy and I was just looking at it like when I put it on, I was like, it's not the same feeling. <laughs> but it's still cute, it's still cute, it's still cute. Next dress, for this next dress, I feel like she's gonna be my birthday dress, like for my birthday that's coming up on September 18th and you know, wish me happy birthday, uh, whenever it does come. <laughs> but 
I got this dress because I saw it on Silhouette Styles from the same girl from the same boutique and I really like it. I love this color, especially for the hair color that I'm thinking of doing next month. I feel like it's gonna definitely match the vibe. Nice and short, super girly. You know, like, I like to be girly sometimes, so. <laughs> it's a wrap dress, so you do have to tie it in whatever. I really like that vibe because I love the deep plunge neck. That is like my thing. I love the ruffles. I love the color. I feel like it's matching my hair color really nicely, but yeah. For a birthday dress for my birthday, looking for something to look cute in. And this is something you can wear like on a date after you can go to a concert i don't know but this is definitely a dress that i will be wearing quite a few times same boutique silhouette styles i got this bodysuit that's in like the nudish color i'm wearing this with my amazon biker shorts so don't come for me but this is the bodysuit i think it's really cute i did think that it would be a little bit more nudish, like a little bit more see-through, but that's okay. It's just the vibes that I'm getting I'm comfortable with. But I really like this because I mean you can wear it with any outfit, and I haven't gotten a bodysuit like this. That's. I just have I'm very particular about how things hit my shoulders because my shoulders are broad and I'm, I don't like to look like a box, but then I like them to look boxy sometimes. It's just my head. Oh, so this is the last top. I promise, I promise you. I thought I got this top in blue, but she came in pink and bright colors still work with me, so we're gonna work with it. But anyways, this is a top, it's a crop. Yes, we still love crop tops over here. So yeah, I'm just wearing, wearing this with my biker shorts. This top that I got from Silhouette Styles is this crop-ish like turtleneck top. I really like this vibe. Like, I first of all, black is one of my favorite colors, and I love crop. I love turtleneck. Like, I feel like it's so my vibe. Like, this is so cute for fall, not summer, because whatever. But I feel like you can tie this do whatever you want with it excuse my stomach you know but this is a vibe this is a style i feel like were there other colors maybe but i will have to double check i really like this top and it's very light like i feel like even on a super hot day i could wear this at a bar um because there's just like a lot of air like there's a lot of just i feel like it's very cotton it's very airy like it breathes well but yeah, the last brand that I will be um, showcasing for you guys is from a boutique that I got to model for last year. Boutique owner who's also a photographer, you know, she called me out to do a photo shoot in her boutique in Houston. And I went over there and I just did the shoot for her and then she gave me these two pieces. I loved it because they are so my vibe. thing that I love about like style, especially um, African style. I don't think she's African, but she like a lot of her designs are inspired by African culture and African designs. So she gave me like these pants. And again, her boutique is called A Leap of Style. Um, her name is Carissa, and I'm gonna put all the information down below. I'll even put her Instagram. But these are the pants that she gave me. They are like capri-ish, but they kind of flare out. I will show you. They have pockets, so you know, super easy to like walk around, put stuff in them. Very casual, feel like you can dress them up. But this is very, like to me when I look at it, I'm like, this is definitely like a style that I can see like a Senegalese tailor or person make. And um, this looks like it was tailored and made handmade. So this is totally my vibe for a lot of you people who are out there who are Africans and know how it is back home. Like we go buy fabric, we go get a tailor to make it for us. This is totally the vibe, so I really like it. And then another piece that she gave me was this 
big like black sun hat it's something that I've always wanted to have I love this hat few of you have already seen it because I posted it in some pictures and probably have already worn it I have a pretty small head so this does not fit too snug I feel like there's a hat person out there who could help me out in, you know, making this part like fit my head. But I really like this hat. Like I'm never gonna give it away. Um, it's super cute. Like I feel like this is such beach day vibes. You know? All right, so we're done with the clothing section of the video. For the next section, I'm just gonna be showing you four more products that I've gotten that are black owned. So quite recently, like my style of purses and bags have changed a little bit. I used to really like like the big Michael Kors bags or like the big Louis V like never full bags. Um, still like Louis V never full, but not as enticed to purchase it anymore. Right now, so I've been really liking like the small mini purses and I've just been getting them like affordable prices for now, but sweetie, <laughs> Watch me when I make bank. Like, you know, obviously I don't really care to go get like a bags from like these big brand names anymore. But I have been seeing like purses from like small, like even there's like this Senegalese brand, this girl who sells like really nice handmade purses for $300. $400. I mean, it's real leather. People are making them really good quality. So that's kind of what I'm into. So I just like leather. Leather is just like, I don't know, I just like leather. Um, so this is a purse that I've been wearing a lot. This is another one that I like, like a little whatever that I got from like TJ Maxx. Whatever. But anyways, what I'm trying to say is that like I'm really into like the small mini purses right now. So I found a brand on Twitter again on the thread. And this brand is Nigerian. Um, it comes from the owner, she is Nigerian. And this brand is called Jooms Accessories. I don't know if I'm saying it uh, correctly, if it's Jooms, Jums, but J-U-M-Z Accessories. Let me show you the tag. And I really like it. Um, it says on the tag that the bags are handmade in Lagos, Nigeria. So, pretty excited one of them I've been already wearing for the past two weeks like every other day that I don't wear this orange one I wear this black one and this I love it it's like a cute little triangle purse I really love this purse like I can put my phone like I already have my wallet and stuff in there but I'm able to like put um, well this wallet from Thailand thanks mom my mom went to Thailand and she got me all these wallets because I really love handmade things I don't know I really like handmade things it's just like it just means more to me but this purse super nice this is like a velcro inside uh, my mask but I'm able to put like my wallet my phone hand sanitizer lotion lip gloss all in this tiny little purse here and it does close you can carry it here it has this long strap here you can probably put the strap inside and just carry it from here but I just she's so cute I love black as I told you guys black is just easier for me to like make an outfit into something um, so I've been wearing this purse a lot and then this other one that I got I just really love it first of all I'm not a snake person I hate snakes but I really loved like the yellow and the green just design to it it's just so pretty I have not worn it yet because I just don't know where to wear it or sometimes when I have something new I'm kind of like I want to save it for like when I want to wear it for the first time so I can feel like good I don't know affordable cute shipping came in like less than a week obviously I'm gonna try to get more bags as time comes she had like a red one she had different ones that they're just so cute and I know that there are other brands um, of purses and stuff so if you guys want to comment down below those companies as well go ahead and do so let them know that ah uh, if they sponsor me 
Okay. We have two products for black owned skincare. Right now I'm changing up my skincare because it just needs to it just needs to change. Um I've been loving my skincare routine as of late. I really love how my skin is looking. Obviously, like the texture is not the greatest yet. Like I don't have like skin clear, but it's getting there. But um well let me just go and ahead and explain. So I am changing up my skincare because I am <laughs> joking. No, but no, seriously, especially for women, like for us women who really care about like skincare, even men, like just when we get older, some of us really care about our skincare and um, just maintaining this youthfulness. So I've been trying to work with discoloration texture um, moisturization hydration SPF during the day always like I can't even leave my house without putting SPF like I will feel like I have just backstabbed my facial routine for months before that like we're not doing that today but anyways I have been doing again my research on Twitter and I follow these two black estheticians and they, one of them is actually followed by Barack Obama, but one of them put this product down, um, Good Molecules. This product is made to target hyperpigmentation and promote an even skin tone. So that's what I'm looking for. That's why I'm feeling more comfortable doing like the no makeup makeup look that you see here that's gonna be posted or should be posted on my video um, because we should feel confident in our own skin rather than covering it up I mean do what you want sis but I feel like I need my skin to be perfect in order for my makeup to come out looking really nice so and yeah, and then also like when I take off my makeup, I like to look at my skin and be like, bitch, you're still popping. So, you know what I mean? So I've been using this for the past two weeks and I feel like it's done, you know, it's, it's been helping with discoloration and all that stuff. Of course, I feel like I need a little bit more time to kind of see. And there wasn't a lot of discoloration on my face per se, to be honest. I just had like a few marks that I wanted to get rid of. But I've been really liking this product. It's been doing her, its job. And she came with a free, silicone free priming moisturizer. And this moisturizer is actually really nice. I really don't know what priming moisturizers mean. Like... Yeah, I don't, I don't really know what a priming moisturizer means, but I just wear it as a primer um, sometimes. And sorry, I use it as a moisturizer sometimes, and it really actually does a job during the day. Next one is actually a lip gloss that I just received this morning, and I purchased this from what's her name? <laughs> ah! Glogetta Cosmetics. Okay, and then I saw, because you know, like a um, beauty supply store is. That like that lip gloss, like that shiny lip gloss look that we like from back in the day. I was just like, oh, I'm sure like there's a black owned person who makes those. So I went ahead, saw this girl's um, brand that's called Glow Getta Cosmetics. Isn't that so cute? Glow Getta, like go get it, but glow. And then left a thank you note, which is so cute. And I wore this in the video that I did for this no makeup makeup look. But the tube is pretty big, so you're going to be getting a lot of product. Um, mm. Moisturizing. Ooh. And it has blue glitter inside, but it doesn't turn your lips glue. It just... I do see the sparkles on my lips, but... She's moisturizable. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed all the products that I showcased today. Like I said, ladies and gentlemen, if you want me to do more videos, please sponsor me so I can do that for you guys. So I can show the people watching my videos that there are, um, there are companies and businesses out there that are here for us 
um, to purchase and share and all this stuff. Another thing that I want to say is that all the owners and all the brands that I purchased from, everyone was very responsive. Everyone was very fast at you know responding. So actually, like all the black owned products that I've purchased from this summer, makeup, hair, clothes, all of that. I've just gotten a good response with, you know, management or not management, but like customer service, like shipping is amazing. Shipping is fast. If I need to change an address, I get an email the same day, especially from these small brand owners that I've been purchasing from. A lot of them are just like really great with reaching out by email, reaching out to make sure that you got your order, making sure that you liked your purchase. Um, my girl from Silhouette Styles, when she saw that I repurchased, you know, she sent me another separate email saying like, hey, I realized and I saw that you repurchased for me and I really love that because it shows that you liked our products and all that stuff. So, it, you know, it makes people, it shows people that there are people out there that care about supporting them in their business and their hard work. And if you want to go ahead and do your supporting and do whatever, go ahead and click on the links of these businesses. If you know any other businesses that we can support, we can give our money to and all that stuff, put them in the comments below, like I said before. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's been a long summer, guys. It's been a long summer. But man, the... <sighs> what do they say? Not the marathon, not the marathon must go on, but we must keep pushing for um, recognition, for support, for black money, black economy, black businesses, and all those things. So yeah, we do what you can. That's all we ask. Honestly, do what you can. That's actually gonna make change and do lifestyle changes. But anyways. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you enjoyed this segment. Hope you are having a beautiful, great. Please feel free to go watch my latest video. Any other things on my channel, watch, like, subscribe. Please comment. But other than that, you guys, I will see you next week and stay blessed.